Hey there, Metalheads, Flying V here, and today I'm going to show you guys how to disassemble and reassemble a Sega Genesis cartridge. It's pretty easy. Okay, first you want to flip the cartridge over, and you'll see there are these two weird-looking screws here, okay? What you need is a 45 millimeter game bit. Um, you can't find these in a hardware store. You gotta buy these online. You can find these on, like, eBay, Amazon, etc. Okay, so... Pretty simply, just stick it in one of these uh, interchangeable screwdrivers, and then you go to the two screws and remove them. Okay. Once two screws are out, the back piece will simply lift off like that. And then you'll reveal the board. And then you can simply um, lift a board out. And then you can put this down. So, um, yeah, as you can see, here are, all the, uh, here are all the things here. You got, you know, all your chips, uh, your save battery... Uh, and a little capacitor here, and some resistors. Um, if your game has issues, even though your console works fine, um, I recommend you you um you uh, use like use a voltage meter to check the voltages of all of the chips uh, and see if anything's wrong. If there's anything wrong, I recommend you like restart the chips or something. Okay, I'm not going to show that in this video, but you could do that. Okay, so, uh, that's all you need to know. Now, let's put it back together. You just do vice versa, okay? You simply stick it back in the cartridge casing like this with all the solder joints facing you. Um, take your back piece, stick it back on there like that, and then, and then, um, put, put both game bit screws back in. Okay, that is how to disassemble and reassemble a Sega Genesis cartridge. Okay? Of course, I'm using Troy Aikman Football as an example here. So, uh, so that's it. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe, and share the video if anyone needs help on this topic. And may the force be with you. Wash hard.